Hey, what's up guys? Joey Cassa here with More Than Dogs. I want to talk a little bit about steaming buns. So in Chicago, soft buns are a big deal. We've actually had complaints when we first started out about buns being too hard. So when we steam them, what we do is we poke holes through them and we turn it upside down and put it in the steamer, which allows them to get soft without getting soggy. When the plastic's ripped open, you're going to get the condensation from the lid dripping onto the buns, which makes them too wet and too soggy. You'll also get complaints about that too. In the south, in Tennessee, when there's hot dog stands all over the place, it's a lot easy for, easier for them to have soft buns because they just put them out in the sun and let them get soft naturally. Here we have unpredictable weather. Sometimes we're in a trailer, sometimes we're in a storefront. So the best way to get a nice soft bun for your Chicago dog is to put them in the steamer and keep them in the package. <clears throat> All right, so we just had a customer, so I didn't get a chance to show you what happens when I flip it over. But I just poked my finger through one of those holes that I poked with the scissors, and I slide it open nice like this so that it still has a flap. That allows me to pull a bun out and keep the rest of them protected from the condensation. And you can see now the buns are nice and soft. They open really easy, and that allows us to put the sausage link in there and go ahead and add the toppings. All right, so some time has went by, and you can see here the, all the water that landed on the plastic here. So if we didn't open it the way we did, a lot of these buns would end up getting tossed because they'd be too flimsy and soggy, but instead, they're in pretty good shape still.